Now first, I've got my hammer block safety to safe, just in case my thumb slips off the hammer when I'm letting it down. First thing you want to do is pull the hammer fully to the rear. That eases the hammer off the trigger sear. Now pull the trigger, let the hammer ride a hair forward, then let go of the trigger. Then ride that hammer all the way forward. Always maintain control of that hammer. Never let that hammer slip. There's some lever guns that don't have that hammer block safety. And even though this one does, I still don't let that hammer slip forward. It's a bad habit to get into. Let's try it again. I'm going to cock the hammer. Pull the hammer fully rearward. Pull the trigger. Let the trigger go. Ride that hammer. Easing it all the way forward. First, pull the hammer rearward as far as it'll go. Pull the trigger. Ease the hammer forward. Let go of the trigger. And ride that hammer with your thumb all the way to the half cock sear. Let's try it again. Pull the hammer rearward. Pull the trigger. Ease the hammer forward. Let go of the trigger. And ride that hammer to the half cock sear. That's how you decock your lever gun. This works for every lever gun I have ever picked up. Just make sure that you ease that hammer forward. Don't let it fall out from underneath your thumb. There you go. That's how you decock the hammer on your lever gun.